Hello YouTube and welcome to another Linux tutorial. So today we'll be talking about this useful command called Disk Usage. So already let's get started. So actually the Disk Usage command is used in order to see the usage of files and directories in your machine. So here I'm on my desktop directory as you can see. So by default it will check the disk usage in your current directory so if I tap just GU here it will give me the disk block on my folder one which is in my desktop directory actually and here my current directory represented by dot but I can just specify the path to the directory I want to check usage disk of so I can just type disk usage and my home I mean uh, desktop okay so it gives me actually the exact information but as you can see here it displays numbers that represent disk blocks but this is not readable in order to make them readable all I have to do is to add option minus H actually the H stands for human readable so now I can see that my folder one actually has a total of disk usage of 31 megabytes and my whole desktop directory have a total of 35 megabytes okay but as you can see it doesn't give me information about the files that contain my folder one and my desktop so in order to display the disk usage of each file and directory I can just add the option minus A which stands for all and now here you can see actually each file in my desktop so my folder one has almost or actually three files there is one file.mp4 that has a total of disk usage of 31 megabytes okay and here in my desktop there is a file called file ac that has almost 3.1 megabytes and i have here a couple of text that are empty and one that are actually almost 4 kilobytes okay and at the end there is a summary of the total disk usage of my whole desktop if I want just to get this total I can just type disk minus s which stand for summary as you can see now I have a total of 35 megabytes on my whole directory okay but let's say that you want to actually exclude some files type from your uh, from your summary actually okay as you can see here I want to exclude for example this file here called last.mp4 which has a size of 31 megabytes so I can do the same common but I have to add an option called exclude so I want to exclude which is equal to the patterns of my file that I want to exclude so let's say I want to exclude all files that have the extension of mp4 okay and I type enter as you can see now my whole directory has a total size of 4.1 megabytes because I excluded the big size file of mp4 format okay so this is a very useful command that you can use in order to check the disk usage of any directory inside your machine. As always, I hope it has been informative for you and I want to thank you for viewing. Bye bye.